From his titanic struggles challenging the deep to the global issue of climate change, James Cameron held a capacity audience in the palm of his hand at a talk he gave at the Otago Museum. Away from the talk, he explains there's a bit of difference between the replica submersible in the exhibition and the one he used. And then the shop that, that, that I was in, and I didn't have this nice big hole to get in the side like this. It was a much smaller hatch about that big. And if I'd gained any weight, this is the hatch. That's the size of the hatch right there. He's in the city to mark the halfway point of his Otago Museum exhibition, Challenging the Deep. Cameron owns a farm in the Wairarapa and is critical of the environmental impact of farming, saying methane is one of the biggest things we have to wrangle in this country. He's used to crew wrangling and in the case of the submersible, getting into tight spaces. So I would come in through, you can see the, this is the window is here. Down here. So I literally would enter through the, the hatch that had the window in. Earlier in the day, Cameron treated 20 lucky competition winners to a private tour of the exhibition, where he shared anecdotes about his expeditions and movies. In 2012, the acclaimed explorer and innovator became the first person to reach the bottom of the 11 km deep Mariana Trench alone, in the submersible he helped design. As he lives part-time in New Zealand, there's every chance he'll be back. In Dunedin, the South Today.